Right, the good news is that this is one concert ticket sale that appeared to go well. Our newsroom is not hearing from devastated fans as we often do when a concert sells out in five minutes. You know, there were no secret pre-sales and Garth Brooks's people worked hard to make sure that everybody had a fair chance this time at getting one of the 65,000 seats in Paul Brown Stadium. Tickets to Garth's May 14th show went on sale at 10 a.m. and it appears that most people who got into the Ticketmaster waiting room this morning at 10 were able to get tickets. We found a few upper deck seats still available for $84 late this afternoon, though the lower bowl and field were completely sold out. Now, among those stressing over getting tickets this morning was WCPO's very own super fan, Julie O'Neill, who patiently waited for her turn to come up. Listen. Ticketmaster. And now I need to find the one that actually says Ticketmaster. Yeah. All One right. minute? Yeah. Oh, I'm going to be a nervous wreck. Adrian, please help me. <laughs> How many people ahead of you? 2,000 plus. Ahead of you? Yes. <sighs> Sit tight. We're securing your verified tickets. <laughs> get over here. <laughs> Did you get them? Ain't going down till the sun comes up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is the name of a Garth Brooks song. And yes, a very happy Julie O'Neill got two tickets in the lower level for $99 each. Now we're checking and right now we're finding a few upper deck seats left. If you want the field or lower bowl, you'll have to buy from a reseller. Those seats are selling for about double, even triple the face value as much as $300.